Welcome back to my channel video. I know you are seeing the same clothes as a video that I might put up before or after this video Or maybe I have worn this top before Just look at the title you know the difference of the video because I'm not gonna buy a clothes I'm going to wear for one time in my life. Just doesn't make sense. I'm not that rich bitch yet Yeah, so today we are here with another video and Don't forget to like and subscribe before I start this video i'm trying to make very quick because i have to get my son from summer school <laughs> and yeah so don't forget to like and subscribe and make a girl feel good it's only free <laughs> i always thought i wouldn't be that type of um youtuber who always you know but i don't even do it especially like i feel like i have to make somebody feel um interesting in the conversation like i'm speaking to you guys and you have to feel interested anyways today i'm here with some something that might scare people away or something that might make people comment and say that stupidness everybody has their own opinion on this if you know i was raised in a village and I, my parents are 60 60 plus years so there are people who have lived they live life and they are still living thanks god and they know more than we do so that this is things that their parents taught them and parents before before taught them so here we go with some superstitious saying or phrase or things that people say etc i might not give all today because there are so many but the ones that come in my mind right away i would try to give it to you guys okay and if i don't say all I maybe will make another video because this is very interesting okay and if you don't agree with what i'm saying uh these things don't come only from where i come from i mean like i've met people from different countries like for example let me give you the first one i met a friend when i was in high school and she is italian with muslim origin and she taught me that whenever inside your nose is scratching there is somebody that likes you or love you or uh, maybe i can't remember exactly but if you know, inside is scratching there is somebody that loves you or like you or if outside is scratching there is somebody that hates you there is somebody that just can't stand you or maybe the, the opposite way but you get what i'm saying so if inside is scratching like you just say i know it's scratching you there is somebody that just can't that like you and outside is scratching there is somebody that can't stand you or oh, if you're watching this my italian friend correct me please I thought there was more things that she told me, but I just can't remember. Yeah, so let's go into those that I was raised up. I was raised up uh, with. Uh, yeah, let's, so let's go. We're going quick. Okay, if for example you dream of babies, you dream of babies, okay? This means that there's going to be a problem in your life. There's going to be a problem with somebody. And it can probably mean death, okay? Dreaming babies are very, very uh, dangerous. Don't dream about babies, okay? <coughs> so that, that because you dreamt about a baby doesn't mean that you're going to give birth to a baby. It can mean problem, it can mean death, okay? And it might not come straight from you. It doesn't mean, not because you dreamt, it doesn't mean that you are the one that's going to have the problem but it could be someone in your family or something okay next is oh my god it's like a, every time i'm making a video i keep forgetting okay so if you dream teeth as well like you you, you dream that you are taking out a teeth you have toothache it means that somebody is going to die in your family or around your family or someone around is going to die another saying is that whenever a child like you have a two-year-old or one-year-old and you realize that this two-year-old keeps bending down their heads direct direction to the ground this means that somebody's around you is pregnant okay Whoa! also when you saw when you see a lot of birds flying around one area someone around is is going to get pregnant or is pregnant and i have experienced this a lot and 
that's my opinion it's true it's true it's true yes. so another one is whenever you walk backwards you're going to lose your mother don't walk backwards like you're walking backwards towards the back and not facing the direction that you're going you're going to lose your mother don't walk backwards okay why am i thinking there's so many and it's like in front of the camera i just getting blank okay let me see we don't hit children with shoes you know some people you get mad and you want to hit with shoes it will make them want to it will make them drivers if you know from dominica you know what that means drivers hitting if i remember well hitting children with shoes make making children drivers which means that they will want to be on the streets all the time because shoes are made for walking on the streets so they will want to be on the streets all the time there's another one if a little child likes to put the grown-ups shoes in their feet my mother told me that so if you watch there's somebody who likes to say that <laughs> if you're watching i knew this as well okay so if, it's a, if a child likes to wear a grown-up shoes often you know how children likes to put grown-up shoes in their feet it can make their feet bigger get bigger okay so for example you at home and your elbow bounce okay your elbow bounce here we have your right hand and your left hand so if your right elbow bounce somewhere in the house like it just bounce your right elbow bounce this means that a woman is coming to visit your home there's a there's a lady right means for lady a right a woman is coming to visit your home and whatever so if the left one bounces your left elbow bounces this means that a man is coming to visit you you might not it might not come at your home exactly but you might meet him somewhere on the street somewhere yeah, you want to interact inter you know with some somebody and if your hand is scratching you this direction this way well, not behind this way your hand is scratching you i'm not sure if you're from dominica and you realize that the, old, the older people scratches their hand and they kisses their hand this means that you're going to get a money somewhere you don't have to be young it's like five euros five dollars ten you're going to get money somewhere okay money that you was maybe not expecting or money that you're expecting you're going to get the money somewhere so we scratch it and kiss it <laughs> and it's like come money come <laughs> yes yeah, so if the other side of your hand is scratching some people um have the opposite way of saying this but this is how we do if the other side of your hand is scratching you this means that you are going to spend 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 so you maybe realize that your hand out of the blue just gets scratchy scratchy you're going to get a little change all the money you to coin or something somewhere somehow okay so another one is whenever you come from the funeral walk and whenever you come from a funeral and you go to enter into your into your home walk backwards so that you can leave all the spirits out there all the funeral spirits so that they don't come into your home so you walk backwards you enter your home backwards if you don't know what backwards mean like your back you enter by back okay when there are plenty clouds in the sky if you're a fisherman there are plenty clouds in the sky this means that there are plenty fishes in the sea okay like this is time to go and get some fishes okay another one if there's a lot of flies um, especially here yeah around coming around this means it's going to rain very soon okay, we have this story about pregnant ladies pregnant ladies or wait, let me see. babies let's talk about babies a newborn if there is someone around who has their period who's on their period they are not advised to carry your newborn because they say that these pregnant these people, women with period can take they suck all the energy of the child take all the strength of the child because they're having a period they're losing blood and they you know when you have a period you're losing blood and you're getting weak you can suck up energy from that child okay so it's, it's not advised too, especially if it's not your family member i think you don't have a choice like but yeah so whenever we have a newborn and someone wants to carry that's why we don't let people carry what she newborn like that we ask you do, you do you have your period are you on your period because if you have a period don't come and carry my child and take my child energy you know what i'm trying to say so yeah another there's a there's a green insect 
which flies around it's very green and they say that if that green insects i can't remember what's name but it's like a grasshopper but it's not a grasshopper it's more like a little ship like this you know and if it like lands on you this means you're going to get some money somewhere okay there's another thing as well if you are standing on a tree or somewhere and out of the blue a leaf falls on you you put it in your pocket this also means money like you can get some money you put it in your pocket and leave it another thing is that if you have like you have a let's say that is a paper bill and you maybe realize some people like to fold the paper bill and hand it to people if somebody is handing you people be like that fold like that like fold look look okay <laughs> they want their money to come back to them okay in one way or the other it might not be coming back from you but they want their money to come back to them like they are spending they don't want to spend i'm going to do like that so my money will come back to me or you may be realizing dominica we they fold the head and the head of the, of the money like that and it's, it's for the money to come back they want the money to come back come back to me come back to me please and there is also whenever you're drinking you're drinking a beer you're drinking alcohol and that is your first shot your first drink out of this alcohol or whatever you're drinking they say you need to pour some pour some on the floor on the ground outside so that you can feed the deaf the dead people feed the dead people so that you maybe i think it's get protected especially if you are driving so feed feed the dead people no protection um there are so many and like they are all right 12 minutes inside so i think i'm going to maybe say one more and if ever you are interested in this type of superstitions let me know so i can make another video about it um i'm looking for one more one more what is it maybe i'm i'm going to say something for those who uh having a babies like if okay there's this one if ever your ears is ringing somebody is speaking about you like you know sometimes you hear, hear your ears ringing somebody is talking about you whether it's good or it's bad if somebody is on your name somebody is talking back about you and there's also this one if like for example you're there maybe not eating but you could be eating as well and out of the way you just bite your tongue like your tongue you just bite it you know when you can bite a tongue with your teeth but you don't you didn't do it especially you just bite it on uh, and that painful bite somebody is talking really bad about you like really you're really bad like this person don't want you to survive <laughs> this person don't want you this person maybe <laughs> somebody is talking about you so whenever this happens we try to get a collar and bite it back and you kiss bitch what are you talking about me for so that maybe come back to them because okay and we all know for when you're carrying a baby uh, we can know if a woman is pregnant first of all because usually you don't when you start walking you start walking if you're right foot especially if you're right-handed whatever I don't, I don't i'm not a professional in that but we realize when a woman is pregnant she start walking with her left foot okay left foot left foot and whenever you're pregnant and you don't know the gender of the child as yet we all know for sweet things girls salt um salty teen boys so whenever you're trying to conceive we insist that the, the, the male eat a lot of salt if you want a boy eat a lot of salty things if you want to, so that's salty things can transfer to the sperm which turns into a boy blah, 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 blah. if you want sweet things eat sweet um if you want a girl eat sweet things and um we all know that girls pregnancy are worse than boys so there's a lot of things like for nausea being very much more nausea give you an indication that it might be a girl being very much more nauseous and the type of things that we eat which is very long so yeah 
I think I'm going to stop here today. And if you like this video, don't forget to give us thumb, don't forget to give a thumbs up. If you like this video, give a thumbs up, like, 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 and tell me if I should continue with this superstitious type of thing if you don't believe in it that's up to you that's your problem but as i said i was raised by people who are, can be your age twice three times about now so you don't have to be true but and after we might say be back in the time people were so close-minded they were so close-minded like like very superstitious and close-minded like there's a lack of knowledge of a lot of things but anyways i don't think that can compare to that that's that's a whole other not another story it's like a series i have been watching anyways goodbye thank you for watching subscribe i'm going to get my big me my child from school right about now and tell me tell me something comment below let us know what is your thoughts about this be respectful please because if you are not respectful i'm gonna block you simple as that okay.